I'm Linda Rayner, career strategist and coach, and I've helped hundreds of job candidates land their dream job offers. Now, when it comes to answering the where do you see yourself in five years interview question, I've seen a lot of people struggle with answering this question. And that's completely natural because some of us don't even know what we're doing tomorrow, let alone in the next five years. But the key that you want to remember to answering this question successfully is to focus on what you can give to the employers rather than what you plan to get out of the company or the role. So let's talk about it through three specific tips. The first one is to break your answer down into two to three year chunks. This helps the interviewer to visualize and see exactly what you're describing. What do you plan to do in the first two to three years? And how do you plan to take it up a notch in the two to three years after that? The second tip is to make sure that you focus on the high level intentions that you have for the role and the value that you plan to deliver within each of those two to three year chunks that you describe. And finally, the third tip is to stay away from talking about job titles that you want to get in the next two to three or five years, because that can come off as overly presumptuous. So to recap, make sure that you break your answer down into two to three year chunks talk about your high level intentions and value that you plan to offer in the role. And then finally, stay away from job titles. Using these tips, you'll be able to answer this where do you see yourself in the next five years interview question successfully.